Alright, cool. I'll see you around one o'clock. Alright, bye. Hayden, what was that about? Babe, I get a real big drop. It's an emergency. I'm sorry, I can't make it to the beach today. Hayden, Aloysius Wilson, you will not put God out your thoughts, eh? Oh gosh, Paula. It's money. Don't get on sona. And besides, don't, don't talk about this in front of the children. Hayden, it's not always about the money. You need to know when to put aside your work for your family. That is more important, you don't know that? Paula, you know I love my family, but you know that things tight too. How else are I supposed to support you all? Daddy, you're not coming to the beach with us? Gosh, please daddy, I was well looking forward to going. Whole week we've been studying for exams. You see? You see how you're making it turn upset? Oh God, not me and this again, no? You're always fighting and it really doesn't matter. And anytime we say we're going anywhere, we do end up going. So it's best we stay home. And look at you, eh? always on that phone. As soon as something goes wrong inside of here, oh, always on that phone. Come on. But mommy, you and daddy seriously always fighting. Daddy, you always do not assist. Every time we say we're going anywhere, you don't come. You always have something else to do. Mommy's right, you're always setting us up. Then you and mommy start fighting and everybody just gets sour. Look how it's starting to fuss already. I want to go to the beach. Hold on, hold on. And Desiree, none of that. This conversation is between your father and I, so I don't see how you get involved in that. It's big people talking here. Yeah, but you're arguing in front of us and about us and about what we are going to do. We are affected by this too. See, this is when my head starts to hit me and I start feeling real sick. Look, Desiree, I'm very sorry. But whenever daddy get a big job, he had to take it. But yeah, every time it has to be some big fight and we become affected because you all argue right in front of us. And mommy, Every time we plan to go somewhere as a family and daddy cancel on us, you just go from zero to a hundred one time. Yeah, well the conversation start right in front of y'all. It's not to say we try to get everybody involved. Look, I understand that y'all get upset when your father and I arguing. But how else are we going to see about it? Y'all don't have to quarrel, mommy. Y'all could just talk about it. Voices don't need to raise and everything doesn't have to be so serious all the time. Daddy starts to shout, then mommy starts to shout. Then we feel like we have to shout. So let's just not shout. And you always tell us that all the time that we don't have to fight, scream and shout, we could just talk? Yes. You're right. We're sorry. Your father and I shouldn't be fighting in front of you all. Big people talk should be dealt among big people. Your father and I don't always do what we're supposed to do. We're not perfect. But we promise to try harder. Look, we're sorry, okay? We're glad that, you know, you, you took the time to tell us how you feel. And you all are very right. We could have done things a little differently. So, let's come up with our compromise. You all are bright enough, and you all are involved in this too. What do you think we should do? We know we need the money, Daddy. Why we just don't go now and come back early and your job is at one o'clock? Mm -hmm. It's 10 now. We could spend two hours, that's better than nothing. Okay, and I promise next time we go to the beach, we'll spend the whole day, cool? Okay, but next time, let's try not to get into a big fight and overreact about these kinds of things. Let's just talk about it. Okay, we promise to try hard. And now everybody grab your towels. Let's get ready to go! All right! Let's go! I hope you can see it.